first, I want to talk to you about why I'm wearing a hat. As you probably know, I'm undergoing chemo right now, and I'm losing my hair. So I think it looks less weird to wear my hat. One of the big areas of prayer that we've been receiving this month is for harmony between you and another person. And this is important on all stages of life. So I would like to talk about that. First of all, you live in harmony with God. You'd be surprised how many people don't believe that. They believe that God is a vengeful old man in the sky that's out to get them. Well, it's certainly not my God, and it wasn't the God of Jesus Christ. God is a God of love, a God of acceptance, a God that has your back and is willing to help. God is a God that is willing. If you're willing, you have to ask God and say, help me and Today, we're asking for help with our ability to live in harmony. If you find yourself in a situation that seems less than harmonious, take a moment to turn within in prayer. And as you do so, feel the loving presence of God absolutely infill you and come through you. And when you do, in that moment, you know that you're God's child and you are created in the divine image of love and peace. You allow God's love to flow through you. And that's a big one because so often we stop it, we block it. We, in our humanness, we say, well, I would allow it to come through, but you're not worthy everyone is worthy everyone needs God's love and you are willing to allow that love to come through you as you and you don't stop it and as it comes through you who's infilled first with that love you are and you feel it you become a peacemaker and harmony reigns in your world I pray today that you have a deep sense of peace and you react calmly to all situations. I pray that you feel your oneness with God and the situation that you thought of as impossible, impossible to resolve, impossible to make peaceful, becomes your opportunity in spirituality to express your love one with the harmony of god you are one with the love of god and you take the first big step towards harmony in your world by allowing an air of peace to come through you and a love of god to all that you meet. I pray that you do this today. You know, in the Bible, in 1 Corinthians 14, 33, it says, God is not a God of confusion, but of peace. I pray that you are also an expression of a God of peace. God bless you.